again, you. When last we left our heroes, I knew exactly where they were. On a mountain and such. But there was like a big explosion of 20, and any lesser man might have pooped a little, but I definitely didn't, and you can't prove otherwise. Now, uh, anyway, time to go over to our digi destined heroes. Hmm. Where are they? <laughs> ah! Dang it! Again? Why do you betray me, Bowels? These, these guys are... I, I don't know. I'll be right back. Tell them to do some exposition for me while I'm gone. Ah! This is what I get for eating chili with every meal. Ogremon! With the bombing of this mountain, our generation's long peace treaty is tragically annulled. How could you destroy such a precious landmark of our peoples? Huh. A clever ruse by a treacherous foe. You'll never trick me. You bombed the mountain. All to get back at me. I know you're still mad I digi-married your sister. You leave her out of this! Fist of the Beast King! Pirate Fist! <clears throat> Both of you, cease your pointless squabbles. You work for me now, and you will execute my plans to glorious perfection. That voice, the one behind the black gears. It can't be. Ogremon works for no Digimon. You'll never catch me working for any. Hey, new boss. What's the plan? Killing children. Sounds easy. <sighs> I can't believe you're my brother-in-law. Silence! Together, the three of us will defeat the Digidestined and plunge the digital world into darkness. Aren't the Digidestined supposed to defeat the great evil of the digital world? And aren't you the great evil? And wouldn't I also be destroyed if I sided with you? Plus, I'm kind of scared of the dark. Ogremon, leave the plans to me, and I will grant your heart's desire. I can have two clubs? I rule all the file island. You maybe want to shoot bigger? All right, three clubs. But only because you twisted my arm about it. <sighs> cool. Enough of this! Devimon, if you're so determined to meet your fate, look no further! I, Leomon, will end you today! Fist of the Beast King! Uh. Fool, I am not asking for your cooperation. I am demanding it. Touch of evil! <laughs> now I think you will find my plans much more agreeable. Won't you, Leomon? Yes, Devimon. You're truly the most vile, disgusting, awful, ugly, horrid-smelling... You can stop whenever. ...putrid, foul-tempered, dim-witted. I made you evil, not rude! Hmm... Hmm... Mm-hmm, mm-hmm... Doo-doo-doo... A little bit of... Yeah. Just a dash of... of yes, Ty. Take in the details. Everything the light touches. Hey, guys. What are you two up to? Hush! Do not disturb the master mapsman. He is focus. Do you mean cartographer? Eh, mapsman has a better ring to it. I'm marking my turf. I got dibs on all the most dangerous places we've been to. Please tell me to avoid them. Ty, stay safe? He would never. How are we going to revisit anything if we don't mark it on my expertly drawn map? Think! You want to go back to some of these places? The ones where we almost died? Hey, that toy town was really cool when it was on fire. And the trolley car has a lot of potential. I don't think it's been lit on fire even once. Mimi, back me up here. It better not be too dangerous. I don't want to ruin my favorite hat. It matches my Glock holster. How do I both pity and fear you? Uh, what was that? Danger! Don't worry, guys. I got a map to mark these sorts of things. Oh, don't worry. That's just Leoman. He's the friendliest Digimon in the whole digital world. A real champion of justice. That's the worst thing you could have said. Yeah, just got a point. Seven out of the eight Digimon we've encountered outside of you guys have tried to kill us. So are we counting the Numamon as one Digimon or multiple? Guys! Is it just said I was right? Can I take a moment to appreciate this? I want the children. Black gear? Probably. Either way, I'm fighting him. Oh no, guys, he lives by the sword. We gotta move! 
<laughs> oh no! My expertly drawn map! <laughs> Don't worry, Ty! I got this! Pepper breath! Rah! Sorry about your map, Ty. It's okay. It looked way cooler on fire. Don't stop! No matter what, or we're going to die. Hello, kitties. Uh, Patamon? Is this guy friendly too? Oh no, that's Ogremon. He's literally one of the worst. His primary diet is bones. Of the people he murders! Aren't the murders more important than his diets? Oh, you're smart to be ready for the murders, considering your position and all. You kids are done for. Everyone, get him! Torpedo! Wait, they can do that already! Ah! It seems our master's plan was as foolish and stupid as he himself. However, I am compelled to follow his terrible and inarticulate commands. Well then take this! Needle spray! Ow, 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 ow. It seems the Digidestined are further along than I had anticipated. No matter. As I have dealt with their crests, I can simply face them. Here and now! Digidestined! Tremble in fear! It is I! It is I! Demimon! Oh, Dizzy God! My Dizzy Leg! You Dizzy mangled it! Why always me? I'm gonna need to go to plan B. And now the mountain is attacking! There's nowhere safe! Squaw! Howling Blaster! Electro Sucker! Nova Blast! Great job, everyone! We defeated the bad guys! I don't know if we defeated them so much as the rocks fell and then they just left. Smart. Oh, come on! What happened? My stomach! It hurts! And it's shaking! I think I heard it growl at me! I think you're just hungry, buddy. Oh, you're so smart, Ty. Did evolving twice in one day really takes it out of you? Oh, yeah! Oh, so exhausted. Good team effort, everyone. Yeah. If everyone's tired, we should find a place to make camp for the night. If we're lucky, we'll run into another fully stocked fridge. Just exactly. How many of those do you think we're going to run into? Joe's right. We can only get lucky so many times. Yes. Rest well, foolish children. But we shall see just how peaceful your sleep will truly be. Hold on! Is it just that I was right twice? Can we appreciate how monumental this is? <sighs> Killing children is supposed to be fun. The Digimon seem much stronger now. Do you think that's a normal part of their progression? Or because we're bringing out something in them that wasn't there before? Is she saying we suck? No. She's implying that she's working just as hard as us, which is equally hurtful. Either way, they're not gonna be doing much of anything if we don't stop soon. I'd settle for anything, like a cave, or a large tree, or inside a trash can. Well, Ty, you wanna magically manifest something out of the ether for us today? The old thinker's on the fritz, I'm afraid. All that's on my mind is sleep, in some kind of bed. Like a, like a cot or something, I don't know. Like one found in a mansion? You're not gonna find a cot in a mansion, Joe. Okay, then this one must be my imagination. A mansion? Just like home. It just occurred to me that we don't know anything about you, Mimi. Let's keep it that way. Okay, guys, you lightweights are probably gonna need to stay outside while me and Agumon, aka the heavy lifters, investigate. This is likely going to be the most dangerous thing we've ever encountered. Why are you already moving towards the danger? Don't care. I want sleep. But we don't know what's in there. It could be like, like bugs or, or, or rats or bug rats. I know what's gotta be in there. Us. But what if they're spooky ghosts? 
a bug rat. Then they can be joined by you if you stop me from going into that mansion right now. But you guys, we're going inside you, party pooper! Hello? Anyone? I think we're alone here. Well, I don't see a receptionist or a reclusive millionaire anywhere, so I think you're spot on. But there could be squatters, or hatchet-wielding maniacs, or bug rats, or, or, or... Or we found the one area in this crazy place with any semblance of safety. There aren't any spiders here, right, Matt? Don't worry, TK. If there are, Gabamon will eat them for sustenance. Are you sure I can't just eat the delicious food in the other room? How do you know there's delicious food? Oh, you can't smell that then? My superior sense of smell must be a normal part of my evolution then. And not something special you're bringing out in me. Petty later, food down. Right, follow me! Oh, such an incredible bounty! <laughs> well, isn't this convenient? All this hot, fresh food and no one around. I smell a trap. A food trap. Stop trying to hype up the danger, Ty! No one else is even remotely threatened here! Just let us live! Plus, it's already too late for a Digimon. Oh. This is the least poisoned food I've ever eaten! And this plain uncooked rice reminds me of the Yokomon Village! Hey, you guys dying? No? Not yet, at least! Forearms never felt so good, baby! Oh, God, your mouth opens? Okay, maybe it's not poisonous to Digimon, but I might still kill a human. Then by all means, I'll be the taste tester. If I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die full. Well, Ty, you wanna give him a couple of minutes to keel over, or do you have any other way you wanna kill the moon? This is the best food I've ever eaten. Yeah, kale stuff. Yay! A real bed! <laughs> <laughs> I've never experienced this. Why am I happy? I'm just happy that the supply closet was full of identically sized bathrobes for us to change into. Shame about the spare one. How was I supposed to know it wouldn't fit me? These sheets are almost as soft as the Egyptian cotton sheets Daddy got me back home. Mimi, are you rich? Where do you live? According to our tax records, we live in Ireland, but our bank statements say we live in Switzerland. It's hard to keep track. Right. Speaking of home, I was thinking, this place is really nice. Maybe you just stay here. It's a common survival tactic to stay in one spot to be easier to locate. No one's out there looking for us, Joe. Do you really think they stopped trying to find us? Mom and Dad wouldn't stop looking for us. Assuming they started in the first place. No one is out there looking for us because we're in space! Or an alternate dimension! Or an alien world or something! A place full of adventure! You guys saw everything from the mountain! I mean, we might just be in Hokkaido. No one knows what Hokkaido looks like. Hokkaido doesn't have trolley cars! It's famous for having... Uh... Boats? I don't know, I have no idea what Hokkaido is. <laughs> Using the vehicle that is Christian symbolism, we are now prepared to strike. Was there a reason you wanted to hide in the wall that whole time, boss? If you had full control of the house, it seems like you'd want to make your own room to oversee everything. Our evil overlord must have wanted to occupy a passageway as narrow and dim as his own mind. Yes, yes, you're very snippy. Now that the children's guard has been lowered, our time to strike grows near. Pay close attention, both of you. Your placement in this manner is critical to the success of my plan. Ogremon, you Whatever! Uh -oh. This place is full of danger, and I'm gonna prove it! Starting with the statistically most dangerous room in the house, the bathroom! Crap, scatter! Wait, where was I supposed to go? Where was I supposed to go? Agumon, you almost done in there? Uh, we have three other stalls to check for danger. Almost, Ty! They put a whole roll of origami paper in here, and I folded two swans! That's what you were doing? But Ty, the swans, they love each other! They've been friends for as long as they've known each other! But oh, what's this? What is it? Did you find something? The swans! Time is driving their once beautiful friendship apart! Can we forget about the swans? Jimmy doesn't have as much time as he used to with his wife and kids! And Petrinka has just closed on the house! 
My mom doesn't even know how a mortgage works. How does Patrika? No, no! The floods are coming! But the swans haven't reconciled their fractured friendship! And the prom is tomorrow! Have the swans tried setting something on fire? That usually gets me out of most binds. I think Timmy the swan is willing to give it a shot. We did all we could. The swans died in the fire. But they were holding hands. Truly, a bittersweet end. Wait, swans have hands? You almost got me. First with your boring story, then trying to drown me, and finally trying to smoke me out. No wonder Devimon wants you dead. Truly, you are master tacticians. Who the heck is Devimon? And now you've wrestled critical information for me. You must be stopped. Everyone, quick, wake up and get out here! You'll never believe how right I was! <gasps> it is regrettable, but your path ends here. Ha! You'll never take me alive! Ogamon, oh, execute plan Zeta Alpha! But where am I gonna get a hay glider at this hour? Improvise! Does anyone want to go check on Ty? No. no. Yeah, me neither. Cease your shrieking, child. <laughs> you now face a master of evil. Wait, hold on. Are you like the devil or something? In a manner of speaking, I suppose. Ha! The actual devil is in here! I told everyone this house was haunted! Suck it, everyone else! Interesting pick this year. No matter. Behold, as I shatter the illusion of this place that you thought was a calming sanctuary, but in fact was a trick by I, Javimon! Huh? Whoa, okay, someone's going on a watch list. Where did our clothes go? We are 12! You're going to jail! I am literally the devil. Wait, where's the eighth one? Am I early or is one of you late? I don't know what you're talking about. Come down here and fight me, actual devil! You must be the courage one. What's going on? What does that mean? Tell me! I want to know! And that's the knowledge one! That's a strong head start for me. I'll figure out the rest of you later, assuming you survive. Yeah! Such an unnecessary feature in a bed! We'll see who survives whom! Oh, come on! Great on time! I can't die! I think it was something I ate! Or something you didn't eat. You see, everything in this place was an illusion. Crafted by me, Devimon! The food, the bathrobes, the rooms, even the bathroom with the origami paper dispenser. All Devimon. Timmy and Patrico were real to me! They were real to me! Your mentor Jedi may have taught you well, but he has not taught you of the crests and the power they contain. Without them, the digital world will be mine, and you will not take that destiny from me! I don't know what you said- Devimon! I don't know what you said, but you make it sound like there's a great power, and I'm gonna take it from you. Foolish child, look, I have turned even Leomon, one of the mightiest allies of justice against you. I have never met this lion person in my entire life before today. Your brag means nothing. Ha! Your bravado is much like my master's scheming, pointless and prolongs the inevitable. N no, hey, H help! SOMEONE HELP ME! Huh? I am myself again! Quickly, child! There's not much time before I'm subdued once more, or failed outright! You and your friends are the chosen Digi-Destined, whose role it is to defeat the great evil of the digital world. The eight of you wield Digivices like the one you possess now! They are the key to unlocking great power. There's only seven of us. Oh, yeah, you might need a crest or something. You'll figure it out, I'm sure! Oh, Leomon, you are as loyal as you were powerful. Ogamon, dispatch him! You're a fool not to join with Devimon. Soon, he will conquer the digital world, which your house is in, and where will you live then? You may best me here, but I have told this Digidestin everything he needs to know to defeat your evil forces. I didn't write anything you said down, and you said Digi a lot. So I'm lost. Don't worry, Ty! I forgot everything as well! Go now! Ah! 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 Leomon! You're the one with the 
plan! Why aren't you going instead? I have to hold them off at any cost! Regroup with your friends! It's your only hope! But they're just gonna turn you evil again and use you against us! I'll make sure that doesn't happen! <laughs> Liam! I'm okay. Oh, cool. All my clothes are in bed with me. TK! Where are you? TK! Matt? Oh my god! Uh, help me! Izzy! Have you seen TK? Are you serious? Glad to know our friendship means so much to you. TK! Just TK! Where are you? Uh, Matt, we need to get you to shelter. You don't have a guru room on pelt like I do. Wait, that's a, that's a pelt? I, I thought it was your skin. It's kind of both. Oh, look, a cave. Let's... TK! TK, are you... <sighs> it's okay, Matt. Let's look on the bright side. We got this cave, and we've got each other. Would a nice warm fire cheer you up? There you go. It's not okay, Gabumon. I just got thrown through the sky on a flying bed and separated from all my friends by what I can only infer to be the literal devil. <coughs> you have no idea what I'm going through. Yeah, that does sound pretty rough. What would make you feel better? I'd feel better if I knew my brother was safe. Well, then I'll go find him. Wh what? Yeah, I can go find him on my own. I'm big and strong, and the cold doesn't bother me. Anyway, sit down and get some rest, and I'll be back before you can say I have troubles at home. I don't know, I can say it pretty fast. Make sure to stay here and stay safe, okay? Bye! Maybe Gabumon's right. I can't do everything on my own all the time. Gabumon set me up with this nice cave, warm fire, and he even formed a one-man search party. TK will be fine. He has Patamon. Who hasn't actually tried to save him, even once, and perhaps is more detrimental than beneficial, and whose only form of self-defense has the same amount of strength as a ceiling fan. TK! Well, I haven't found TK, but I have found nothing, which shows me where TK hasn't been. Wait, has that lump of snow always had pointy hair? TK. That's no lump of snow! That's Matt! Matt, why did you leave the cave? I don't care how turtled your neck is, you don't have sleeves on that sweater! T.K. Oh, this is bad. I'm gonna have a Matt-sickle if I don't do something drastic. Think, Gabumon! What would Matt do for you in a situation like this? Okay, what would Matt do for T.K. in a situation like this? Oh, I know! Okay, now to tuck him in. <sighs> Good night, Matt. Sleep tight. Well, that was the sweetest and yet most disgustingly terrifying thing I've ever seen. Kind of like a Sour Patch Kid. Like, okay, they look like disfigured golems wrought by the hands of a haunted creator, but then the catchphrase is Sour Sweet Gone? Where do they go? They could be right behind you at any moment. Plus, you know they're gonna start off sour. A anyway, anyway. I think that Goggles kid is still lost at sea. We should go check on him. As I was saying, we've been adrift at sea for a whole day-night cycle, screaming all the while, but we've made landfall, and that means mission accomplished. Go us. What? Akumon, stop playing in the snow. Adventure and Frostbite are equally in the air. <coughs> oh, hey, my clothes. Oh, the screamer. Oh, the ice rift really got me. <coughs> no time for that, Akumon. Light my clothes on fire so I can wear them. You got it! <gasps>
According to my pocket telescope, everyone has been separated to different islands. It seems my old foe Devimon is challenging me to one-on-one -on -one combat. Obviously, I accept. I'll make sure not to hold you back, Ty. <laughs> yeah, I... Wait, what? When you fight him, I'll make sure not to interfere. He's got shins, so you can, like, kick him or something. Well, I thought it'd be you and me fighting him together. Okay, but that sounds like 2v1, and that's not very sportsmanlike. He's the literal devil. This is life or death. Oh, well, if that's the case, we should just gather all the others and fight them together. Hmm. I don't know. That doesn't sound very sportsmanlike. Frigimon! Hello, new friends. My name is Frigimon. Oblige me with the benefit of your. You don't look like you're from around here. But with all the shivering, how about I fix you a nice cup of tea? Ty? Do I like tea? Dang it! I thought we were gonna fight. I wanted to see a fire types beat ice types. They don't! This ain't your daddy's Pokemon games. There's way more to it and it's super complicated, so that means it's way more fun. Here, I'll explain it to you nice and simple. Okay, so Frigimon here is a Norwestern Frost Oligarch, meaning that whenever he taps a terrain card for pylon resources, he generates 10% additional Warmble Resonance. Now, normally, an Ice-type government official like Frigimon can only resonate a Warmble thrice! Write that down, that's important. However, Norwesterners gain additional Tectonic Resilience, allowing for the minus six armor class penalty to stealth while wearing plate mail to be mitigated and... Good to have you back in our fold, Leomon. Now everything is in place for my plan to succeed. Just to ensure my victory, though, I will send these black gears to corrupt the most powerful Digimon near the Digi-Destined. They're Digimon partners, of course! I... no? Other Digimon nearby. Oh, sorry. Wouldn't it have made more sense for you to separate the Digi-Destined from their partners, instead of splitting them up into pairs? That way the Digimon are stuck in a weakened state, and the Digi-Destined are no more than frightened children. Well, um... I, I, I didn't want to win that easily. Apologies, my Dark Master. I failed to identify your sense of chivalry. How dare you accuse me of having such a thing! You know what? I didn't call this meeting to collect feedback! I'm sending out the gears! Thus, whilst Agumon wields the Sword of Cthulador, he can overcome his Ember Peasant class restrictions, thus becoming a level R service worker, and in five to seven business years, can become middle management, abuse his power, and fire Carmacular the Desert Wench for calling him a weenie in middle school. You still taking notes? Oh! Oh, jeez! Oh, that's bad! D did I do that? I didn't do that! I'm getting out of here! You can't pin that on me! Jesus, Ferdinand, they're after me! Oh, goodness. I'm feeling a lot of negative emotions right now. He doesn't seem evil. Maybe it's a dud! Luckily, years of therapy have equipped me to handle these emotions and sort them at my own speed. Maybe they're all duds! Girl. Maybe not. Ah! <laughs> oh no! A dead end! Perfect! This is our first time in a snowy environment, so it's time to execute Plan Alpha. It's weird that this is the first plan you came up with, by the way. Scarecrow formation, initiate! <laughs> our crops are safe. Sub Zero Ice Punch! Yeah. <laughs> All this trick in the book. In a shape, I Football form, go! <laughs> Robot noises. Ready! Kill! Now to show you what got me kicked off the soccer team. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Pepper bread slap! Gee willikers, I got so rowdy there. Sorry I got so cross with you new friends. It's okay. I wanted to beat you up. Well, I don't know how I feel about that, but at least everyone is happy. Well, now that we've bested you in combat, we really should be heading out. I gotta go beat up the devil or something. I don't know. 
I'm a busy guy. And then when we find all of our friends, we can tell them about it! Hmm, you raise a good point, Algamon. It's not as cool if they can't ooh and ah as we pull off cool attack moves. Plus, who's gonna clap once we beat him? <laughs> this guy? I mean, I could. Unacceptable! Algamon, commence operation, get everyone back together! Well, your plan sounds super complicated based on the name, so I couldn't possibly understand the intricacies. But I did see a blonde-haired child fall screaming from the sky on a bed nearby. That sounds like TK! Old, reliable TK. The useful one of the two brothers. Lead the way, old frosty one! It shouldn't be much further now. We're about to run out of island! TK! Hello? Is your backpack still full of food? All that castle stuff was an illusion, so I haven't eaten in days. TK! <laughs> TK? Gobblebug? Don't worry, Matt. I used my own fur to k keep you warm the entire. Someone here is looking for TK! He's made a full recovery. TK! Wait, that sounds like. Ty! <laughs> the. V there he is. There, that's that's uh that's my guy. You forgot my name again, didn't you? <laughs> the mere thought that I would forget your name, Bethany. Not my name. Of course it is. You're just trying to embarrass me in front of Froggymon. Hi, Bethany. I'm Frigimon, also known as Froggymon. Apparently. <laughs> oh, your friend is sick. There's only two locations on this island capable of growing medicinal herbs. I'll brave the danger and retrieve them for you. Good day. Well, you heard him, B-Town. Danger were afoot. We must away! Wait, what about TK? We have to find him! He'll be fine. He's got Palmon! He has Patamon, who hasn't done anything useful since he got here. No, he could turn into a crazy missile walrus thing. No, that would be Gomamon. And I'm beginning to worry that you've made any decisions for us at all up to this point. Patamon hasn't digivolved, period. Huh. I thought we all did that. Ah, uh, maybe your brother sucks. Have you considered that? Maybe you suck. Have you considered that? Well, that's impossible. I have the pocket telescope, and that makes me the leader, and leaders never suck. You suck, you sucker. I am sick of dealing with your half-baked plans and complete disregard of others' feelings, Ty. Matt, I think I caught a cold. I'm also feeling kind of sick. Not now, Gabumon. I'm making a point. I'm sorry, I'll go back to the cave. You guys have a cave? Lucky. You had half as much brains as you have hair. We'd be home by now. I'm taking matters into my own hands, and I'm finding my brother. Matt, wait! How will you know where you're going? You don't even have a pocket telescope! Jeez, Matt, I know you're usually uptight, but this is ridiculous. I mean, what's your plan? Wander around aimlessly till you pass out from exposure? Shut up! Yeah. You couldn't possibly understand what I'm going through. You have no idea what it's like to be an older brother. You have no idea what it's like to be an older brother. Stop it, 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 Oh, you pushed the wrong button. We were playing on your battlefield, Matt, which was words. But now, we're fighting on my battlefield. Which is fist? It's TK, okay? I'm upset that he's out there all alone again because I'm failing him as a big brother. I'm supposed to protect him. And I don't know if I'm ever gonna see him again. Things are already rough when our parents broke up and now he's left alone hurting. He's left alone hurting. And if I'm feeling this bad, I can't imagine what he's going through. He's just a little kid. It's not fair. Not <laughs> I finally did it. I beat someone until they cried. Oh god, I'm becoming my mother. That's really touching, Matt. You're finally opening up. You're also on the edge of a cliff! <laughs> it's okay, Matt. I got you. 
Because I'm the leader. But I don't think this branch has allegiances. This branch doesn't recognize that I have to pocket a telescope. Don't worry, guys. We're coming to get you. Gabumon, do you hear approaching danger? <laughs> Jeez, I gotta go, buddy. I got a job to do. <laughs> this guy's Mojaman! <laughs> I'm not sure how they say hello where you guys are from, but where I'm from, we do it by saying hello. Hello! Frogimon! Frogimon! You stopped us from dying with your soft and flexible spine! And you brought us food to eat so we can defeat Mojimon! Some of these were my groceries, but to help yourselves! You always do! That one's a suppository, by the way. <laughs> now, I'm sure you're feeling aggressive right now. I know I was when I was full of gears, but I think at times like this, a deep cleansing breath would help you to. Oh god, I'm being thrown! <laughs> Whoa! Oh, come on! Execute plan beta! Oh! That one's my favorite one! What? Agumon! Gabumon! Digimon! Great job, Garurumon. You got the stick. Oh, Nova Blast! I'll hold him down. You go for the black gear. But Froggymon, we might hit you too. And then you'd get sent to a big snake thing in the Cloud City and have to talk to a blue guy with antennas and sunglasses. That sounds super unrealistic. Now use your dinosaur friend to blast the evil piece of machinery controlling this yeti so you can fight the devil. Nova Blast! <laughs> oh god. Woohoo! Do the tie dance. Uh huh. Howling Blaster! Wait, was that good? The blasting? Did that do anything? Is the island evil? I think I feel the island moving again. Just like islands are all known to do. We are indeed moving back towards Infinity Mountain. And my old foe, Devimon. Our old foe. I'm sorry, what? What makes you think we share foes? I mean, he's more my enemy than yours. He sent my little brother flying to a remote island. Hey, if he messed with Kari, he'd already be dead. Wait, who's Kari? Oh, she's my little sister. You have a sister?! And with that final shocking revelation, two of our heroes come a-sailing on an island towards the devil. But where's the rest of them, you may ask? Will they ever find that TK-1? Has my getaway driver and stalwart companion Ferdinand received medical attention yet? Will his mistress Henrietta ever find the buried gold of Hernan Cortez? And did I, your lovable narrator, find said gold first and hide it in a new spot Henrietta would never think to check, aka a hole under my race car bed? Find out next time on Digimon Abridged! Limp this way, Ferdinand! The ambulance won't take your insurance! Hey there! I'm Logan Laidlaw, and in this schmuckle of a duckle, I play Devimon. You may also know me as Blazing Azure Crow of Project Mouthwash, where I do lots of stuff. If you like this episode, be sure to subscribe to the Abridged Alliance channel to check out all the old schmuckles and tune in for new duckles in the future. If you like what I did, be sure to check out the Project Mouthwash channel for our abridged stuff like Unlimited Blade Works Abridged, Bleach S Abridged, 
and other. As well as, you could check out the Nat 19 channel, which is where we do all of our Nat 19 D&D, under the title of Vestige of a Fucus. Also, we got lots of cool guys who do stuff over there as well during the week. Anyhow, thanks for having me. It was a great time. Schmuckle to Duckle Boy.